The Tektronix WFM 5200 is a great complement to a color correction suite. Let's take a closer look. On the left side of the WFM 5200, there is a row of buttons. The top buttons labeled 1A, 1B, 2A, and 2B are SDI inputs. The next button down is labeled EXT REF or External Reference. This selects the External Reference menu. The next button down is Help. It is the on-screen Help menus. Next is the Config button. The Config button displays the WFM 5200 configuration menus. The Display setting shows the current settings of the bottom selected button. The Main button displays the menu that controls the settings that affects the main display and the bottom button is the power on and off. On the right side of the WFM 5200, there is a column of buttons and three knobs. The top knob is labeled General and can be used to roll through menus vertically. The middle knob is Vert. It adjusts the vertical position of the trace in the scope. The bottom knob adjusts the horizontal position of the trace in the scope. Below that knob is a USB port for saving or loading files. A headphone jack is located left of the USB port. At the top right are four arrow buttons with a selection button labeled SEL in the middle. These are the navigation controls for all menu selections. Pressing the button and holding it will enable submenus in most selections. The gain button enables a 50% magnification. The Sweep button selects the waveform display style and sweep mode for the display. The Mag button is the magnification setting. Pressing the button and holding it will enable submenus for different size magnification settings. Line SEL enables the line select mode. The adjustment knob on the top right allows selection of the individual line you would like to monitor. The cursor button enables the cursor in the waveform display. The capture button enables the capture mode. The preset button enables the preset menus. The bottom of the WFM 5200 has eight buttons that change the display modes. The WFM selects the waveform mode. The vector button selects the vector scope mode. Pick selects the picture mode, audio selects the audio monitoring mode, gamut selects the gamut mode, status selects the alarm status mode. MEAS or measurement selects the input timing mode. The button labeled other is used to display a timecode waveform, external reference waveform, and diagnostic monitoring. On the back of the unit, there is a VGA remote port, reference loop input, SDI out, power input, Ethernet and DVI connection, and four SDI inputs.